right now i'm in my word file and here i type hello how are you and you can see these keystrokes down side how you can get it i press command z but if i go to finder anything i just press enter command c you can see it displayed here now i command shift and new file command v here and drag them to this folder and everything i do on screen you can see as i press command z or shift z shift a all these are displayed here in the bottom how you can do that easily for your screen recording or any kind of tutorial i'll post the link in the description this is the link here you go and here you will find different solution and this is one of them just go to ecaster.app.zip download this one it has started downloading once downloaded go to your folder like that and i have already downloaded here in my applications you just need to double click this one and unzip this file here I have already unzipped so you can drag that one to your application like dragging is easy once you are in applications you go to this one double click and it will open once you open you just go to this place you need to see little tiny icon there this is your key caster you also need to go to your settings once you install in the setting you go to privacy and security and in privacy and security go to input monitor and here keycaster is not allowed you just go to plus icon use the passcode modify setting here you can go to your application wherever the application is in the application i dragged it into the folder my extension and here is keycaster you just need to open this one i have already given access so you just need to turn on this toggle turn it on quit and reopen once you do this one you need to go to your display setting this will appear here and if it's not you just mistakenly closed it you just go to this little tiny icon or you can also go into the setting in the dock but here right now i'm gonna go to preferences and here in the display you can also choose you want to choose that you want it in the dock here as well or not if you want to choose it will appear here in the dock as well and if you just want to choose in the menu bar it will appear in the menu bar at the top corner all right go to the display in this setting if you check mark this one command keys only then it will show you only command keys while i'm typing something hello are you today it will not show you the keys but once i press command a it will show you the command keys so i just normally leave it up to this place like i show all of my commands here you will set the font let's say i have this word file side by side and if i increase the font here the keys will be increased like this one hello you can see they are bigger and if i more increase up to the hundred percent and i press command z you see it's the bigger one and in the meantime you can you know choose the delay between lines let's say d d d d d d like this one and the delay time will be there so in the meantime you can also link your time between like it's time shorter or increase the fade in duration let's say hello and it will stay on the screen for a long time then it will fade away so i just keep normally up to this place and font i just choose the normal font not way more bigger and in the meantime you see there is a circle on my mouse i can also place my circle and my mouse wherever you see a little tiny mouse was appear here now if i click anywhere you will see a mouse here i click outside you will see this one here so it's the mouse animation along with your you know keystrokes so you can also go with this one and in the meantime just none of these one that's all right up to you you can also choose the color whatsoever color in the background let's say i want to choose any color instead of this gray scale color i can choose any of these colors from the drop down list here i can also choose the opacity and text color and this text color is white i can choose any of this one let's say it's red and if i press command a now this is red okay now the color is changed i press command a and it's white again and you can decrease this size as well now there is a great way that it appears in the center 
how you can bring it in the center i just figured it out once i press these keys it's in the center of the screen not way more right side or left side so i can bring it easily here let's say i'm gonna press any key and hold it like this one now you can drag quickly just go to this one hold it and place it here like that and now if i press command a then it will be in this corner now i press command a hold it and bring it here anywhere i like now it will appear here hello we got it right so command a man v v v v v like this one it will appear at this part of your screen so this is very nice trick if you want to just move this one to another part of your screen that's it you can just enjoy your free stuff here this one is a free stuff you can enjoy this one i'm pretty sure this will be very helpful for your next tutorials if you like this video then thumbs up and subscribe i'll see you next time bye